We are learning new details about a plane crash that killed a Knoxville businesswoman and her father. That plane crashed earlier this month in Middle Tennessee. Here are three things to know from a new report that NTSB released today. First, the report says the flight took off from the Knoxville downtown island airport around 10 in the morning and was headed towards a small airport in Benton, Arkansas. Jenny Blaylock was flying that plane and her father, James Blaylock, was a passenger. Number two, about an hour into that flight, the report says the airplane started to descend rapidly before air traffic control lost contact with the pilot and the passenger. It says during the last several seconds of that flight, the aircraft was falling at a rate of more than 11,000 feet per minute. And finally, the airplane crashed in a wooded area near Pulaski. That's in Giles County and about an hour and a half south of Nashville. The cockpit was destroyed on impact and no flight instruments or gauges could be identified or recovered from that crash. Again, this is a preliminary report. The NTSB has not revealed what they believe caused that crash.